What's up, guys? I'm Yoxers Game, and I'm back with Pokemon Red Part 18. See, I told you I would upload them frequently. I'm not actually sure if I am. I'm actually recording this right after I recorded the last one. Did I say the last one was Part 18? No, I don't think so. This is Part 18, but maybe I said that by the last one by mistake. Last was time was Part 17. This time was Part 18, and I'm recording this sitting in a bed, crisscross, applesauce, and my legs are starting to get um, fairly uncomfortable and tired. But our team, as you can see, is not doing so well. Um, Charmeleon's fainted, Carmel's on low HP, but they're, uh, actually we're doing pretty fairly, we're doing okay. Just two Pokemon are not in the best shape, but that's fine. We still got Hermione, we still got Dugtrio, or Cole, whatever. Uh, I don't remember why I called him Cole. I know it was after my friend Cole, but I don't remember why. Like, I think there was some trait about him that reminded me of my friend Cole. But I don't, I don't have any idea what it is. Oh well. Um, this is a wild Zubat, I don't know why I'm fighting it, but it's dead anyway, because, you know super effectiveness, so uh, I kind of feel like I'm still recording the last video, because uh, why do I keep running into wild Pokemon? I need to get some repels. That's, guys, that's something I'm going to do next time. I'm going to buy some repels, I'm going to buy some great balls, because I have zero of both of those, and they're both very important. Because, oh my gosh! This is ridiculous. Um, I used to record videos like one after the other all the time, but I haven't done that that much recently. I feel like I should do that more often so I don't run out of videos to upload because like I record once because it takes time to like set up my recording setup so if I just record a couple in a row then that makes it so much easier but what takes the most time is just like Photoshop because I mentioned last time I kind of pirated Photoshop so it takes like forever to turn on and like kind of broke my old computer and yeah not not great but so it takes way too long way longer than it should to make thumbnails for videos which is part of the reason why I sometimes just don't I, I have stretches where I don't upload videos also I'm just kind of lazy so like, even though I love making videos, sometimes I'm just too lazy to like, turn on my computer, set up every capture thing, make sure everything, there's no nothing wrong with it, and then there's almost, no not always, but a lot of times there's some technical stupid thing that I have to fix, and that like, I just am so, I procrastinate about that so much, which then kind of hurts my channel, but you know, it's fine, I fixed most of those this weekend, the weekend's probably over now by the time you're watching it, but when I'm recording this, it is... Monday, so let's look at Psybeam for a second. Um, we just got a brand new Psychic type move. That's interesting. I don't know what the difference is between Psybeam and Confusion because in this game, unfortunately, it doesn't give you the description of the moves. I think Psybeam is just more powerful and maybe has a better chance to confuse. I know there's also Psy Wave, which probably isn't in this game. Psy Wave is a weird move. It's like does damage based. It doesn't have a power amount. It's just like I remember the description of Psy Wave is just like some weird thing. I don't know how it. How much damage it does, but it's like it does damage based on some random thing. But uh, if you know what, what Psy Wave does, explain to me in the comments below. But I'm pretty sure Psy Beam is like 65 power, while Confusion was like 40 or something like that. But Psy Beam looks very powerful, and because like 65, a 65 power move is much more powerful in uh, Generation One than it would be in like Generation Six. So that's a pretty powerful move, and it looked very powerful. And uh, where am I going? And I keep forgetting which way we're supposed to be going. And it just, yeah, that looks very. I'm very glad we learned it because Confusion was powerful enough, even though it only has 40 power, just because of how powerful Kadabra is. And now we got Psybeam, and we're just going to be destroying everybody and everything. Do we ever have a matchup? I, I don't know. Um, let's run because only level 15. Let's check our Pokedex. If we have a matchup, let's see matchup. Where would a matchup? He matched up from this Pokemon that I kind of thought was Gen 4 when I was younger, because he's in Gen 4, and Gen 4 is my first generation. Match up. Same with Tentacruel, I thought it was Gen 3. I wasn't sure if it was Gen 3 or Gen 1. Uh, Onyx, we do not have. I didn't see match up. Probably did, but okay. I definitely saw it, but I didn't notice. Let's see. Match up, match up, match up, match up, match up, match up, match up. I don't know why I'm wasting time doing this. I just want to know if I have one. Magnemite, no match up. Match up. We do not have a match up, so. Uh, if I run across one, I will try to catch it. Okay, we have not battled this guy. So we are going to, um, I think after this we might switch it up, use another Pokemon. Because we've been using uh, Hermione a lot, and you know, it's... I don't like about, what I don't like about Pokemon is some of the, a lot of like the areas are way too standard with Pokemon. Like, I get all the wild Pokemon being the same, like all the wild Pokemon being like all rock types because we're in a tunnel. But why do the trainers have to have all rock? Oh, I didn't mean to switch. Although, no, I didn't mean to switch. I want to see, I want to see if Psybeam can take out a Graveler in one try. I don't know if we've seen a Graveler yet. It's the evolved form of Geodude. Um, but, like, I don't like 
I don't like why. Why does every trainer here need to have a grab or a Geo dude? Why can't a trainer just have a random Pokemon? Like it's not like the trainers need to have caught all the Pokemon here. They could have just they could have just came from some random place. Why can't this trainer have a Gyarados or an Arbok or just something random? But not all Geo dudes. That's annoying. But um, Graveler. I've never liked Graveler. I don't think it's a very worthy of like I thought Geo dude's pretty cool. Then I remember saw Graveler. Same thing. They were also in Gen 4. I was like, oh, are they Gen 4 Pokemon? When I first started learning about different generations. But no, they're not. Um, Sable Subat actually was in Gen 4. But, uh... Um, what was I saying? Yeah, just... Graveler is just kind of weird. And then... It's not... I don't think it's very good evolution to Geodude. But then, Golem! What is with Golem? He just is this random thing that looks absolutely nothing like Geodude or Graveler. Like, Jude, Jude is this, like, gray rock thing, and it evolves into this bigger gray rock thing. It's uglier, but it still makes sense. And, had, and this bigger gray rock thing has four arms now. Four arms. Not, like, four arms, like the bipart. Like, four, F O U R, arms. But then, Golem comes along, and it has this weird head. Like, before, the head was just in the body. Oh, Jake, the ice. But now, the head is, like, out of the body, and it's a completely different color, and the body looks completely different. And it only has two arms now. It just it doesn't. Why would it go from two arms to four arms to two arms and kind of have a completely different design? And it just doesn't just doesn't make sense. It should like be its own Pokemon with its own pre-evolution. Should not like it doesn't make sense. Golem should not have anything to do with Geodude or Graveler. I don't like it. it does not make sense. It angers me. Wow, Hermione's actually. I I mentioned last video that I feel like Hermione levels up slowly, but I do not feel that way anymore because just in Rock Tunnel alone, Hermione has leveled up three times. But Carmelo is still sitting here at level 25, but he's kind of maimed, so I can't really... Oh, Parasilton! Why am I not using Parasilton? Oh, I guess because of all the Geodudes, yeah. Forgot about that. I don't know if I should waste all my side beam. I'm probably almost done with side beams. I'm probably almost done with this dungeon anyway, so... I said dun... Whoa, I burped, sorry. I said the word dungeon way too much in Rock Tunnel. It's not even a dungeon. That's not even, like, an actual name. That's just what I've been calling it. It is a tunnel. It is Rock Tunnel. We have Meowth. I'm going to use Parasilton. I should not... I don't know why I keep using Hermione, because... Parasilton needs to be leveled up, so Parasilton can learn Spore. And I really like Meowth in this game, I think I mentioned this last time, but, or not last time, a couple times ago. But like, I think the anime kind of ruins Meowth for everyone, like, no one likes Meowth, but like, in this game, Meowth looks very likable, like, it's, oh, it's a cute cat Pokemon, but later on, Meowth is just like, ah, Meowth, blah, 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 I'm evil, and then like, even like, his, sp like, in, j in uh, ex like, I can only see ex uh, Meowth, and just think of the anime Meowth, so, like, who wants to use Meowth? Also, Meowth is just a bad Pokemon. I think Meowth would be incredibly forgettable, incredibly forgettable, if it wasn't for the anime. Because, like, when have you seen a Meowth in the games? Like, really? Is that even, like, a thing that exists? Meowth in the games? I don't know. But, I mean, we just saw one, but it's a rare case, guys. And, like, this is the first generation of games, but, like, later games? Like, when did you see a Meowth in Pokemon Diamond? Like, no, you didn't. You didn't ever. Probably. Let's use Paris. Oh, Paris has on low HP. Fantastic. Um, we should have some healing items, though. And I'm sure we have plenty of money. Let's... Yeah, we have plenty of money. I need to buy some stuff. Um, super potion, boom. And I should use one on Carmelo too. Um, I think after this, I need to go to the PC and manage my items a little bit because I don't know what the maximum is for the inventory, but I'll find out. I'll definitely find out, and then I'll manage my items accordingly. And stop running into Pokemon. I need to get some repel. Like I really, really, really need to get some repel because. This is ridiculous. All I'm ever seeing, or all I'm ever doing is running into wild Pokemon. This is not even the right way. Why? Why is it to be here? Can I ride a bike in here? I, I'm not sure. Um, by the way, I think we get a new mic in the beginning of the summer. I thought my mic was horrible, but it was actually my other computer. My mic looks works horribly because of something I didn't realize. Like it doesn't recognize my mic, so it uses like the wrong software. So a lot of my videos in the series just sounded terrible, but. Um, I realize the problem now, but either way, oh, sorry, I hit my mic again. Either way, this mic does not sound that good. So it's, it's pretty, it's okay. It's much better than I thought it was, just because some problems that I had. But I think I'm going to get a new mic this summer. Just like you know what else I think I'm gonna get a new uh, this summer. I think I'm gonna get a gaming PC. So that is something I'm very, very excited for. So I'll have much, much, much less technical issues. I'll be able to do all this stuff that I want to do. I'll be, I uh, can't escape. Um, I want to stream more this summer too. That's another thing I want to do. I have so much, so many plans for my channel. I just need to keep uploading daily because I always am like, oh, I need to do this. Oh wait, 
or I want to do this, but I'm in the middle of doing this right now, but if I actually, like, you know, upload regularly, then I can get all this stuff done, but I don't do that sometimes, because life, life is busy. Life makes me busy, guys. Life, I'm sure life makes you busy, too. And I totally feel you, because it does the same for me, and we are the same level. How am I? I gotta switch out of here. Send in my man, Cole, the Doug Trio. Uh, I wonder which one of them is the real Cole. I think it's the one on the right. The one on the right looks the friendliest. The one on the left, I don't even see ahead of, and the one on the top, well, now I can't see any of them. But you'll see in a second. The one on the top just looks kind of scary. But the one on the right, that's the real Cole right there. The other two are just Cole's weird friends. But, um, what's he's using now? He's still using Geodudes. So we're still going to use Cole because how, how many Geodudes have we fought in this tunnel? Like, seriously. It's enough. It's enough already. Geodude, come on. Come on, stop. The defense girl is not going to protect you from my dig. I think it's really dumb that they give you a Doug Trio in, uh, Tiglet's Cave. Because it's, it's so high level, like, it's kind of ridiculous, and I will be right back. My apologies, um, I'm gonna have to go out to dinner in like two minutes, I'm going to my favorite restaurant of all time, it's called Finn's, it's very good, it's like tacos, but it's not Mexican, it's weird, it's called Tropicali, I don't know what that is really, but it's, it's just really good, um, but, so I'm gonna have to pause my making of this video, um, so, you're gonna see me in about a second, but by the time you see me in five seconds from now, I'm going to be very full. But right now, I am kind of hungry. Although I'm not that hungry. But either way, I'm probably going to forget what I was talking about, so sorry. Sorry about that, guys. I am back, and it's actually uh, the next day. It's, so now it's like 3.30 p.m. on Tuesday, May 31st. So, um... I don't really exactly remember what we were doing. I know we're going through Rock Tunnel, right? We got Paris Hilton right here first in the party. Everything seems good. I went to my f this restaurant last night, because I think that's where we left off, called Finn's. My favorite restaurant ever. And I wasn't even that hungry, and I still demolished every, like so many, so much food. But um, here's the zoo bat. Um, so yeah, I don't exactly remember what I was talking about, so I'm sorry about that. Uh, if there's something that I forgot to finish saying, let me know in the comments below. But I believe that I mentioned, I don't know if it was this episode or last episode, but I believe that I mentioned something about my weekend, that uh, we, we had a five-day weekend. This is the last day of the five-day weekend. But now tomorrow I'm going to six weeks for school. So it's really a six-day weekend almost, but uh, I'll have some work to make up. But uh, why can't we escape? Anyway, um, so I might have mentioned that I had a really good weekend in most aspects, but then I had this problem, and uh, it really effed up a lot of things. But now, uh, in between... When I started making this video, and now, um, that problem has been resolved, at least I think so. So that makes things so much easier. Now everything's good, and now we're all, everything, I'm all happy, I'm so happy right now. There's so many good things going on right now, and I do have a Pokedex. That's another great thing. This guy doesn't even have one. See how privileged we are, guys? We have a Pokedex. He doesn't. I'm sorry, man, but you have to go to Professor Oak if you want to get one, uh, or one of the other professors. But in this region, I think there's only Professor Oak, but he's got level 20 slow poke. That rhymed. So I think we can, I think we can take it. Let's paralyze it first, because... Uh, it, why? Why didn't it affect the enemy slowpoke? Because I don't think that's true. I think it just missed the enemy slowpoke, but... Yeah, see, I th They really need to... Okay. Oh, nice. Fully paralyzed. Uh, so... Now they say paralyzed can't move. Can't move, but... Now they say full... Or, but in this game, they say fully paralyzed. But let's see if this thing is a psychic type. I think it is. I think it is. I know what evolution is. Is it? It is. I think I did that last part in the beginning of this episode, but I don't remember because, you know, but... Disable missed. It did not fail, but it missed. So, that's good. We're just going to keep leech life and get to full HP. This is actually... This is not that bad of a move, uh, because it's stab. So, even though it's, like, only, like, 20 power, like, in this generation, 20 power isn't, like, that bad, like, because moves aren't as powerful. And it's a psychic type. It's super effective. And it heals us, and we'll finish him off. Oh, cut. Why did Disable cut? What? Oh, yeah, I think I actually remember reading about this. I guess it's a, uh... It's, a uh, kind of a glitch in this game, which makes Disable really bad, because instead of disabling the move you used last, it just disables a random move, so... It isn't really... I mean, it's kind of a useless Disable, to be honest. But, so, another Slowpoke. Uh, we're just gonna stay in, and I think Body Slam... Or, uh, we only have a few Body Slam left, though. We also only have a few Leech Life left. We have, we have like, nothing. Let's, let's paralyze him again. It, it, it missed. Okay. Why is it gonna disable this time? No, not body slam. I guess we're gonna have to stick with leech life. That's fine. That's not. Come on! Oh boy, this is gonna do some damage. Uh, okay, I'm happy with that amount of damage. And finally, we land a sunspore. I don't know why we weren't before. 
Um, hopefully we can get through Rock Tunnel in this episode. This is the second episode of Rock Tunnel. It's ridiculous. This is the body slam still disabled, but it's fine because now that we have lost some HP, I want to get it back. Although I'm kind of annoyed that I'm running out of eight PP uh, ha, in Paris Hilton's moves because I wanted to level up Paris Hilton a lot in this dungeon, but I don't think we're going to get to that much because, you know, don't have that many moves left except for cut and stuns for, but... Um, I think, let's see if we can finish off the body slam. I think we can. I think we can. We can't. That's disappointing. So, let's just leech life again. No, I'll just cut him because I'll save leech life for another Pokemon that has more HP so I can maximize the potential of leech life because I only have three left. And I think, since I have a ton of cut left, I think I can finish it off at the cut and I can. I am glad about that. So, hmm. Another Slowpoke. This is, I, you really, I hate when trainers don't have any variety in their Pokemon. It really bothers me because it makes the game kind of repetitive, but... Whatever, we'll just paralyze it again. We'll just do the same thing that we did the last two times. Um, so yeah, I'm, I'm happy right now. I'm in a good mood, guys. If you guys got any problems, tell me in the comments below. I've got some problems, you know, like uh, why, like the fact that Leech Life is disabled, even though I used Stun Spore, but also like the fact that I have finals coming up soon and a bunch of stuff, homework and school. But you know what? School's almost over. Got like three weeks of school left. I've got, well, see, tomorrow I have six flags, so that doesn't really count. And then I have Thursday, Friday, and I got a week. And then I got four days, and then the Friday's finals. So I've got, let's see, one, two, seven, twelve, um, sixteen days of school left. But a bunch of those are finals. That's not counting the six flags day. And I like that this thing's getting fully paralyzed. We're finishing off... Looks like it's still disabled. Oh my gosh. But, uh, yeah, finish off with the cut. Don't want to waste our last body slam. I think from now on, we're just going to have to keep switching. So they're sending in Hilton, and then switching her out, because, um, we're running out of PP here. Let's see, Carmelo, I healed him up, I remember. But Jim is fainted, that's disappointing. But we can train up Carmelo, we kinda need to do that. Wait, I already went down, why did I go back down? I, kinda, I keep forgetting, like, where I've gone and stuff. Yeah, I really need to remember, guys. Next time we get to a town, we get repels, get super potions, get regular potions, get great balls, go up the ladder. Nope, we're not gonna go up the ladder, because we see wild Pokemon, it's a Geo dude. Whew, okay, I'm getting, like, the sweats right now, guys. I don't know why, I kinda have, like... It's like the sweats you get, like after eating like a lot of like potato chips and like soda, and also like not having showered in like a day. So sorry if that's grossing you out, but I'm just like sweating. It's also hot down here. I don't I don't know why. Eek! Don't try anything funny in the dark. Why is every girl? Why is this game so sexist? Why is not even? It's just why is every girl like think you're, they're gonna get raped? What is something is wrong with Kanto? Like the men in Kanto, there's only a few of them, but clearly the ones that are left. There's something, or maybe there's only a few men in Pokemon because all the others are in prison. Because they seem to be pretty scared. All the girls, like, look at her hands. Like, she seems to be very afraid. And every single one makes like a rape innuendo. Like, that's what the hell? That's that's effed up. What? Come on. That's really weird. Um, I don't think this is super effective. I think poison does poison resist bug? Does I don't think so. I don't think so. Does it? It does not. Nice. Got a lot of HP back from that. I. Let's finish them off with a cut. Don't want to waste all of our... No! Our nose are very valuable, but seriously... Oh, we got fully paralyzed, too. Now, that's... Oh, man. No, don't do that to me. Uh, can I switch out in rap? I don't think so, but... Uh... Oh, I can. So, yeah, they changed they changed uh, rap and bind a lot after this game, but... Oh! Stop! I have to wake up. No! Oh, okay. Sleep and rap. That's a ridiculous combination because you can't attack during sleep and you can't attack during rap. What the heck? This is ridiculous. Po actually, poison and rap would be a ridiculous combination. Thankfully, you can't be sleep, asleep and poisoned and rapped at the same time. But uh, let's just finish this guy off with quick attack because I want to do in the first place. Okay, good. Because Hilton's paralyzed, so I'm not going to find out he's heard that much, but at least Carmel leveled up and uh, flying type move, maybe? No. Didn't think so. Cliff Fair. I don't think I don't really want to use Carmel. Uh, I was gonna use OG Gym. Fine, we can use a coal because Dig is a physical move because it's ground type. And I think Clefairy has a lot of special defense, but not regular defense. I really, I don't know if I'm gonna keep use Carmelo throughout this playthrough. Kind of a boring Pokemon. Only has normal type moves, and I don't know. I feel like I use Pidgeotto or Pidgeot. I mean, I use them all the time, like playthroughs of this game, and I kind of want to mix it up more. So I don't know. Probably gonna switch. Uh, I haven't really. I'm not planning on this team. I'm just like catching Pokemon and using them. Like, I didn't really plan to use Cole, but I'm starting to use him, so who knows. Okay, another Pokemon. It's another Zubat. I, I understand where the memes are coming from now, guys. Like, I really get it. Oh, and we're slow because we're paralyzed, so I probably can't run. That's fantastic. 
Let's just keep trying to run until we can finally escape. And then... Um, okay. So let's... And then we're gonna... Oh, I kind of have five allergies, guys, so... I apologize for that. Uh... Well, let's put Carmelo up front. Because Carmelo's pretty fast, and Carmelo's level 26, but Carmelo still needs to be leveled up. You have Pokemon. Let's start. I'm very glad that there's nothing wrong with this girl. This girl does not seem to have been violated in any way, nor does she fear being violated. And the tunnel isn't even dark. That other girl's like, don't try anything funny in the dark. Yeah, I used Flash. I lit up the dark, okay? Chill out. Oh my gosh. Um, oh, she has a little Carmelo. I like it, uh, but it is going to have to faint on for it. Whoa! Little Carmelo is copying Big Carmelo. It's kind of like my two dogs that I have now. Um, little Doggy and Big Doggy. But the Pidgey is going to faint. That makes me happy. Rattata. Okay. I'm glad I didn't do all of Rock Tunnel in one place, in one part, because that would have been way too long, because this, we're all, this is like almost 20 minutes. It's like 20 minutes. I don't, I'm not exactly sure how long it's been, because I don't remember how long the how long I recorded for before yesterday, but it's been like 20 minutes now, and this is the second episode of uh, Rock Tunnel, so. Is this Rock? Yeah, Rock Tunnel. I was got confused with Mount Moon for a second, but this is Rock Tunnel. Uh, Rattata again. Why? Why? <sighs> Why do they need to identify that it's a junior trainer girl? Like, why is it say junior trainer, and then it has the girl sign? Why can't it just say junior trainer? This is at least Pokemon. Like, I talk about how Pokemon has improved throughout the generations. It's also gotten less sexist, so that I guess that's good. And Jim's painted. Let's use. Let's use. Parasilton's paralyzed. Paralyzed. Mark. Like, paralyzed Hilton. Ha. Ah. Uh, ha. Ha ha, ha, get it? And I would use Carmelo, but you know, flying type moves, we don't have those. Uh, I feel like I say that way too much, but, oh well, this is super effective though. So that, uh, that's critical hit too, but I don't think the critical hit mattered at all, because Hermione is a powerhouse. She is amazing. So, you play hard. Uh, okay, that's a weird thing to say. Stop running into Zubats and Geodudes. I don't, I don't care, I have them both, I think. Actually, I don't know if I have a Geodude, but I don't want one. If I want one, I could just go into a cave and walk two steps, and I'll probably find one. Oh, wow, the game listened to me. Oh, no, it didn't. I need repels. I really need some repels. Okay, I got away safely. Okay, which way should we go? I think that. <laughs> I don't like tunnels in this game, guys. This is ridiculous. This is ridiculous. This would be going so much faster if I had repels. I don't know if I should go up or left. Um, I don't know why should, they like hold out their hands like they're doing jazz hands. It's kind of kind of strange. But Meowth is so cute, oh cutie Meowth. Uh, I can never call Meowth cute anymore though because you know, uh, the anime just ruined Meowth. But whatever, this Meowth I can still call cute because. The anime Meowth doesn't ever do anything like this, but let's finish him off with a quick attack, Carmelo. Nice job, go way before he can even move, and we'll kill him. We're killing him. He didn't faint, we killed him. Uh, Oddish, okay, nice, you have variety, I appreciate it. Um, though, I don't know why you don't have evolved Pokemon. I feel like you could have a Gloom up at this point, but, um, your Oddish is very black, I've realized, and that's a little weird. You know what I wish? So, I'm playing this game, Pokemon Red, on the Virtual Console, obviously, as you guys, um, I think you knew that. Maybe I didn't say. I don't know. Maybe you didn't know. But either way, I'm playing this on the Virtual Console. And what's dumb is they only let you play it in black and white. I'm pretty sure that if you played it on the Game Boy Color, you had some color. And you also could play it on the Super Game Boy, you had some color. So I think they should give you options for whether you want to play it like the original Black Game Boy. Like, we're going to play it black and white, or we want to play it uh, in color. Or they should let you play it in green. Like, you could play it like like the Game Boy actually was. I think they actually do let you do that, but I don't know how. But I don't want to play it in green. I'd rather play it in black and white, but, uh... Because, you know, the backlight of the Game Boy was green, so... Let's see. This is the exit, but I think there's actually... There's one way we didn't go yet, so... I'm sorry for prolonging this tunnel, but we're not running into any Pokemon right now. This is actually fantastic! Oh my gosh, guys, this is unbelievable! But, okay, I'm very happy with that. But we didn't go up yet, so I just want to see what's over here. Match hop! Chop, chop, chop! I... I remember checking before if I'd caught a matchup yet, but then I don't remember if I actually acted upon it and caught one, but I really don't care. I don't, I don't want a matchup. And, of course, there's nothing up here. There was absolutely no reason for me going up here. I'm just going to fast forward until I get out of this stupid cave. 
So we are finally here. I climbed that ladder and we are out of Rock Tunnel. Finally, what does she have to say? I'm feeling a bit faint from this tough hike. You're battling me? Really? Then what if you're feeling a little faint from the tough hike? Why are you battling me? I didn't ask you to battle me. You just... <laughs> okay, whatever. That's gonna be the episode, guys, after this battle. So I'm just gonna um, take out this, this Pidgey. This is a little bit better of Pidgey than we saw before, but still was significantly worse than Carmelo. And still is not evolved. Why? Why is this Pidgey not evolved? I don't know. Can anyone explain? I, I don't know. But thank you so much for watching, guys. Um, that's it. I, like I said, after this is the episode, thank you guys so much for watching. I say that way too much. Why do I always say that? Like, I repeat it five times. I mean, I'm thankful, but, you know, I don't need to repeat myself that much. Um, follow me on Twitch, follow me on Twitter, like, comment, subscribe. And I just did the outro, but... Wow, Pidgeotto looks fat. Wow, Pidgeotto's ugly in this game. In the later games, Pidgeotto's, like, skinny and slender. This just looks like some fat... Ro I don't want to use Carmelo anymore. Carmelo looks like a fat lo rooster. Doesn't look like it from behind, but... Wow. Literally, this thing has a fat rooster. This does not look like a slender bird that's supposed to be flying through the sky. And it missed. That's, I guess it was because I think we got sand attacked earlier. But um, let's just hit this hit this run, Carmel. Good job. Good job. Hit this one. And then a quick attack. Oh, okay. Well, it still needs at least two more attacks to take us out, so. Uh, okay. I don't know why I keep using sand attack. He should really just try to kill me here. Oh, uh, he's dead. Okay, good. So yeah, this is going to be episode. Um, next time, we're going to go into Lavender Town. And I'm recording this on Tuesday the 31st. We're supposed to get brand new news on June the 2nd for Pokemon Sun and Moon. So by the time you're watching this... Oh, by the way, the X button actually works at the start, too. Uh, by the time you're wa watching this, um, we might have that news already. I'm not sure, but... Pokemon Sun and Moon hype! Yeah, I'll see you guys next time!